Hi guys, so I'm finally here. Um, I'm in Japan. I'm in my dorm room at the moment. Um, I arrived here Friday around 9 a.m. local time. Then I uh, got a lift from uh, two nice Japanese men um, who were uh, acquaintances of uh, the two girls uh, who joined me on the flight here to uh, Japan. And today I finally found some time to do some shopping and also to make this video. So without further ado, I'll just uh, go on with the video and it starts uh, from uh, Thursday. Right now I'm in Brussels airport. I just checked in and went through uh, border control. No real problems there. Except I lost my earplugs. So that sucks. But uh, now it's just waiting for uh, two other girls who are coming with me to Japan. So first we're going to fly to Helsinki in about half an hour. And then it's pretty much to Kansai University. So stay tuned. So then I flew a bit, then I arrived in Helsinki airport, and then I flew some more. So then I finally arrived in Japan and got to my dormitory room, which I will show you to you now. This is my room in my dormitory, so it's not really big. A nice closet here with some of my books my bed. So here is another closet. See it's not really easy to film here because it's not really wide. Also if I open my closet... So there you go. Next thing is my desk which I already have uh, pipped with some pictures that my girlfriend has had prepared for me uh, my window my air conditioning and last but not least my fridge and today I went on a little adventure and took a walk around the neighborhood just went to explore a bit I guess um, and I took my camera with me so here's the last part of my video hello it's me again so uh I'm here in uh, Suita, Suitashi. It's a uh, neighboring city of Osaka. So uh, yeah, it's very, very cool here. I'll just have you take a look. That building over there is uh, the local hospital. I hope I don't have to visit that too soon or too frequently. That would be that would be nice. Uh, so I'm living not too far from here. Just need to cross this road. But uh, oh, it's green, so let's go. For me it's really a strange sensation looking at cars driving on the left side of the road. When I uh, came to Japan, two uh, friends of the girls I flew with, um, Japanese guys, picked us up from the airport and I sat in front so it was really weird I've got my driver's license for over five years now and I'm used to sitting on the left side of a car but usually there's a well there's a wheel in front of me and now there wasn't so that was really weird so today's actually Sunday so there are a lot of Japanese people out on the streets now they deserve a day off once in a while. 
and what's great about the working culture of Japan for me is that shops don't usually close on Sunday so I just went to the supermarket to get some, uh, some grocery shopping done uh, forgot to buy some stuff typical me what's great about Japan is that almost everywhere there is a public toilet that you can use for free so uh, that's really handy I mean and they're all very clean I mean Japanese people are very considerate this is the little playground of uh, the park doesn't really have a lot but you, you can see a lot of cute little Japanese kids playing around here it's really cute but I'm gonna try and not film the local residents too much because I don't want to scare them off. I mean, I am one big scary foreigner. Well, not that big, but, but still. Okay, so we're almost there. This is our dorm. As you can see, it's, uh, it's pretty big, but the rooms are very small. And this is the entrance of the dorm. So I hope you enjoyed this video, um, it was a bit long and I do apologize but I had a lot of stuff to show you guys. Uh, next videos will be a bit shorter and also I'll try to uh, pay attention to the angle while vlogging. Sorry guys, still need to get used to that. See ya!